Tropical Hurricane Barrel is moving through the eastern Caribbean as a catastrophic Category 4 hurricane before making landfall earlier today in Grenada. The storm carrying winds reaching speeds up to 150 miles per hour and heavy rains that are causing serious damage. While hurricane season is officially underway, the Weather Authority team says Barrel became the earliest Category 4 hurricane in the Atlantic. News 19's meteorologist Jessica Camuto joins us now with more on Hurricane Barrel. Jessica. Yeah, Tamika, so taking a look at what we have seen from the International Space Station's view of Barrel itself, and you can just see how intense and the strength of that catastrophic Category 4 Hurricane Barrel here. You can see that well-defined eye right there, the strong updrafts associated with this storm, and it's creating uplifting clouds and very strong storms within the circulation. But the eye right there, and you can see the center location of it. Now, what we're seeing with this storm at this moment is very strong winds about 150 mile per hour winds that are associated with it and the eye is still very well defined with the current advisory that came out about four o'clock this afternoon now it's continuing to track further off towards the west northwest at about 21 miles per hour and it's going to continue to travel across the caribbean but what's going to happen is it's going to maintain its strength as a strong major hurricane whether a category four or slightly downgrade to a category three. The one of the main reasons why is very weak wind shear that is going to be across the Caribbean as it travels west northwest. Weak wind shear or that rotation of the winds as we head up into the mid and upper levels of the atmosphere allows the tropical system to strengthen compared to strong wind shear. Another thing that we will be watching in the coming days and how much moisture content is in the atmosphere. Right now there's a lot of moisture, but just behind it, Saharan desert air is going to begin to filter in. So so if it begins to kind of catch up with this system, what's going to happen is it's going to mix in and it could lead to this system and for barrel to actually begin to kind of weaken a little bit. But taking a look right now, it is still a major category four. It's going to continue to travel across the Caribbean and impact the Yucatan Peninsula by late this week and then move into the Gulf. Stick with the Weather Authority, though, as we continue to keep you updated on the latest on this hurricane.